What's up everybody, this is Ingram, and today I'm going to show you how to upgrade to TechIt Lite 0.5.7. Okay, so before we do anything at all, we're going to back up our TechIt Lite server. Now, my mind is just right on the desktop right now, but one of the things I suggest you doing is there's a couple log files that can get really big. I'm just going to go ahead and delete those. We don't need them, they're just log files, and they, uh, because of, I think it's IC2 is in beta, um, it something's not implemented <clears throat> correctly and it creates you know 200 megabyte log file so now we're gonna take that folder now this is the folder that has our entire server in it you don't you really don't want to mess this up so we're just gonna right click our server folder and click add to RAR and let it go ahead and compress that and save it to a RAR file now once that RAR file is completed I'm just gonna take it and rename it to say what version it is and it's gonna be version 052 we are upgrading straight from 052 to 057, which is the latest version of TechIt, TechIt Lite rather. I'm also just going to copy that folder just in case. So, okay, so we have everything backed up. Next, we're going to go to themindcrafters.com, or you can click the link at the bottom of this video. And we're going to go to the tutorial page, which will walk you through everything that I'm going to do here if I go too fast. First thing we're going to do is we're going to actually grab this TechIt Lite uh, download link. We'll go ahead and Start that, and we're going to download the new zip file with 0.5.7. Now, once the file is done downloading, we're going to go ahead and extract it to the same folder that we're working with so that we can see what the files we're going to need to update. Open our, in another window, open our previous server. Now, the process for actually upgrading your server is fairly straightforward, but what we're going to need to do is there's a couple folders the config core mods mods folder and also the tech at light jar file, and we're just going to make sure that those are updated. We don't want to update our server or our launch commands. We don't want to update our server properties because then it'll wipe out what we've been doing. So we're going to go ahead and grab the core mods, config, mods, and TechIt Lite jar files from our existing server and delete them. And then copy over the same folders from the new zip file and put them into our server folder. Now we had dimensional anchor and wireless redstone problems. So we're just going to see if the uh, if the fixes are actually okay. We're going to go ahead, we're going to launch this, and we're going to see what happens. So it looks like our server powered up fine. I don't see any major errors. I don't see any um, chunk errors even, which we had a problem with before. So I'm going to go ahead and log in and see how everything looks. Now the first time that you log in, you're going to need to change your Tech at Lite version. We've been using um, 0.5.2, and that's a configurable option. So open up the Technic Launcher, go to Options, go to Manual Build Selection, and you can either do manual build selection and pick 057 or you can just use always use recommended builds and that will pick 057 for you automatically because it is the current recommended build so we'll just go ahead and do that and then when we go ahead and log in here it's actually going to um, it's going to download a bunch of the updates because there are a bunch of new mods that it needs to have and a bunch of different work that it's going to do okay so here we are we've loaded into our world we're back in our lab and everything seems to be running fine. The server is not complaining too much. Doesn't look like anything's a problem. And there's a couple new mods in here. We'll just check, make sure that they are installed correctly. We're going to be looking for power converters. There we go. There's all the new power converters. We have uh, HV, MV producers, and consumers. These are replacing the energy links. This is kind of a more complicated setup. Um, he does not have oil fabricators in there, but it looks like everything came across, came up well. Um, there was no major additions. We have our, our uh, red power wireless is back in because we had taken that out. Um, and our dimensional anchors are actually back in too. And I don't think any of them are in place, but at least the mod's not crashing straight out. So there we go. That's how you update your server. We are running... Uh, 0.5.7 of TechIt Lite. We just upgraded from 0.5.2. Um, if you skipped ahead in the video, please make sure to back up. If you don't back up, you can really screw your server up. 
Um, and MC Edit, be very careful with that. It does not have compatibility yet for TechIt Lite, and it will randomly add mining turtles into your world, and that can be a big problem. So, all right, there you go. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any questions, if you get stuck, let us know. We'll try and help you out. And as always, stay poised.